Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Tara, a farmer from Northern California. And this channel is mainly about farming, but sometimes it's not. We are out in the vineyard today. It is growing so fast, it's crazy. So today is April 13th. I am running my second irrigation right now. Last year, we did not irrigate until April 25th. That was my first irrigation. So we are having a very, we had a very dry winter and we're having a very warm spring. A lot of 80s, 70s. We even had one day that hit the 90s. So we are going to start sulfur dusting, which I did look and it looks like we're only starting maybe a week and a half, two weeks early, so not too crazy. But we got the sulfur duster hooked up to my tractor. I'm gonna show you guys that. And John is gonna be running the sulfur duster. The reason we dust is to help with powdery mildew. Powdery mildew will just destroy a vineyard. It's like gets in the bunches and it's all mildewy and wineries don't want that. So it is critical that we dust. And normally once we start, we dust once a week for like 10 weeks. So this week, this year could be even longer, but all right, we're gonna go get started. Right. Here is the duster. I bought it brand new last year. It's a rear pack blast. I've been super happy with it. It was great last year. So we got it all hooked up, which took me a minute because it's super funky. You gotta do this whole weird chain thing, but we got it and it's good. So luckily these settings are already here from last year. I have some good notes on my phone. So it's all cleaned out. I'm just gonna get the hydraulics going probably grease it and then we're going to put dust in it. So even though sulfur dust is organic, it smells terrible and it will burn your eyes. So I brought all this stuff for John. I'm just waiting for him to meet me here and then I'm going to show him how to load it up. But I got him gloves, goggles because it burns your eyes these white um, coveralls because it will help a little bit for your clothes not to smell. And then of course a mask and a mask for me. So we're gonna get this loaded up, but we're not gonna start till tomorrow morning, but it'll be good that it'll be ready to go. All right, we've got John in the duster. I had him just put two bags in. We're gonna just make sure it works and then we'll fill it up. There we go, Woo, look at that done. would not dust in this kind of wind but it's not hurting anything I mean my neighbor's a vineyard as well so this is good for him um, but I just wanted to make sure everything looked good and I think it looks pretty good let's take a peek at the vines while we're out here look how fast they're growing guys isn't that insane Whew. take my mask off look at the little baby grapes look at This row is a little weedy, but we are getting the weeds under control. Look at this. Look how big this is. It's already as big as my hand. Look at the little babies. <laughs> All my hard work, you know. I'm hoping for really another, another great year. All right, there we have it. All the sulfur dust ready to go. John looks like a, you look like you're ready to work in like a chemical lab. Yep. <laughs> All right, good morning. I don't think you guys can see me very well, but it's 5.50 and we're back at the vineyard. All right, let's get the shop open get this going okay he's got the fan going so now he just needs to turn there we go there it's coming out and he's off 
I'll try to, well, you guys can't see me at all. Try to get a better shot once the sun comes up. Doing good. Luckily the duster is pretty easy to run once it's calibrated. All right, <laughs> the sun is finally up. It is 7.40 a.m. And I'm gonna go check on John. He has not called me, so he's gone almost two hours. So I think it's good. Can't remember if I said this earlier, so this might be repeating, but I think it took me about six hours um, when I used to do it. It's looking really good right now. He's doing a great job. Grapes are growing. Look how beautiful they look. I'm a little late on this, but John broke the duster. JK, he didn't break it. It got clogged though. And we opened, these are normally closed like this. And the dust has an auger and it goes through here and down and out the blowers. And we opened this and it was solid as a brick here. And we chipped away at it. See this side. This side's a little hot harder because we have this little motor in the way. And uh, we still had no luck, so now John is scooping out the dust. He's a trooper. He thought he was going to get off early today, but it didn't happen. <laughs> Are your eyes burning now? No. It's good. It doesn't bother you. No. It doesn't bother him. Burns my eyes. You show him the bricks down there? Here's the bricks that we, I mean, this stuff is powder when we put it in. Now it looks like we're trying to sell drugs or something. <laughs> so we're scooping it out. This is what I look like because it burns my eyes and I don't want to breathe it in. Well, not that it's that bad. It just gets, I don't think it hurts breathing it in, but I don't know. Who knows? Probably shouldn't while I'm pregnant at the very least. Good thing there wasn't six bags in here. That'd be a lot. He's doing good. We're getting it out. Getting there. Okay, we're making progress. So this this one that you can see is just an agitator. That's a mixer, and then the auger is on the bottom. And where the auger comes through, in there is all packed full too. That spot's a little bit harder to get to. Okay, so we got all the dust out here it is in buckets but uh, let's see so that must be like 100 ish pounds because two, two bags right so 100 ish pounds of dust we actually were able to start it and it broke loose what was in there but then of course it shoved all the broken pieces into the into this pipe so we have to take this whole piece off which isn't that big of a deal, but we're taking this off and then we'll be able to get that stuff out. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's more in here too. Is there? These chunks are rock hard too. That's the worst part. Okay. Oh boy. Is it coming out? That chunk's oh, here. Let me. Uh, oh I can shove it from the top probably. Oh, there, it already looks so much better. That hole you yeah. could see there was completely full. I can still see some chunks. I have to hammer it a little bit. <laughs> hammer it? Yeah. Can't get that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> yep, there you go. Let's see. There. I just cleaned it too. <laughs> okay, I think we did it. I think we fixed it. How long have we been out here, John? Two hours, Two hours guys. John was supposed to get off at lunchtime today and it's three o'clock. So I guess I can't tell him he's not, he's gonna get off work early anymore. <laughs> or if I say it, don't believe me. There we go. It's all empty-ish. And over winter, I completely cleaned this thing out like no dust. And this was our first time dusting this year. So I don't know 
we're not we're still not completely sure where the problem happened we're just gonna cross our fingers and toes that this does not happen again i think everything works so we're gonna just do one bucket because he's almost finished look at him look at his oh my gosh you're a disaster in my defense i gave him some coveralls to wear yeah i wore them in the beginning but he chose against it so we're gonna do one bucket because he only has well, he's got 13 rows left and you only do dust every other. So there's like seven rows left and they're short rows. So we're gonna play it safe. Ready? Okay. Yep. I'll, I will get my pickup and we can put the other buckets in my pickup. And uh, <laughs> nothing's gonna even come out probably. Yeah. But that's okay. I, don't know if that's okay. I think we should just play it safe. Yeah. We'll we'll put the other buckets in my pickup. Okay. All right, John's being a total trooper. It is three thirty. Definitely thought he was gonna be done by noon today. Um, but he's heading back out there, so I'm gonna get my pickup. I'm gonna get the buckets of sulfur and meet him out there. Hopefully, it'll all go smooth. Cross your fingers for me. Moment of truth. Okay. He's going. So far, so good. Eee. We put so little in there, I honestly don't know if he can even make it to the end of the row. <laughs> I just didn't want to dump a lot in there and then it'd be a problem again. I'll go to the other side. I'll go to the other side, meet him. We're just gonna toss one or two buckets at a time, get this thing finished. I don't think any spilled other than what I spilled to start. See how much we used. I was afraid you might not even make it to the end <laughs> with that little. You made it though. Yeah. What are you looking at? Oh, just looking at the, dust. the dust. The dust. Just do, one bucket. I don't know. What do you want to? What do you want to do? Just try two little ones and see how that does. Okay, we can. I don't know. I don't want to get clogged. <laughs> Let's try one other little one. That one had nothing in it. I know. Let me get one more. <laughs> Try a couple. I won't go far. We're making progress. All right, he did it. We finished. Hallelujah. There he comes. Let's see if you can see. There we go. It's coming. I'm gonna park it in the shop. And there's all my sulfur dust. We'll unhook it tomorrow. If you guys enjoyed today's video, remember to hit that thumbs up button and I'll catch you guys next time.